Hello everyone, Tucker and I out and about checking on the produce. As you can see, it has rained again and Tucker is enjoying a drink of water from a puddle in the yard. And we are about to go check on our produce for today. Alright. Come on, Tucker. see how everyone is doing today this wild garlic is doing exactly what it's supposed to do so garlic grows and a lot of insects that attack your regular produce do not mess with garlic I have not had to spray anything on the garlic it's the only thing that I haven't had to treat with neem oil or some type of caterpillar spray um, it pretty much takes care of itself which is another good reason to have it in the garden, but I have to admit, it's not keeping the insects off of the other things, only itself. But it is supposed to fall over like this, it is supposed to bloom like this, so it's doing exactly what it's supposed to do. Now, um, these, these are our banana peppers. They're looking good. Got some bell pepper here. And this is my yellow bell pepper coming along nicely. The squash, some days it looks good, other days not so much. But hey, Tucker, hi. <laughs> hi. You want me to throw that, dude, don't you? There. Hi. But there is a uh, baby squash here. There we go. Baby squash there. And a nice size squash chilling out in the middle there um a couple of them have died off and Tucker and I will have to come out here and cut those off on another day right now we're just walking and just taking a look at everything you're tangled you're tangled there we go you get those cones for me awesome <laughs> now my shoe is better than the cone I'm gonna give you a little slack on your rope so you can go back and get that um Green bell peppers in there. Stand in a little bit. There we go. Kind of got a weird shape going on, but they still eat just fine. We personally like to plant flowers in the garden. The first year we planted, we did not plant any flowers, and everything was just green. And while that's fine, it wasn't as pretty as we wanted it to be, so the flowers are just to beautify the garden. But there is a silver lining, the kind of a kind of a happy coincidence. Flowers bring butterflies and the good bees that like to pollinate the flowers. And it, it's a good thing because certain plants like squash, zucchini, cucumbers, they bloom. And those blooms need to be fertilized or pollinated by nature. So don't be afraid to take a chance and plant some flowers in your garden. Oh, zucchini. Tucker has found the zucchini. Good job, boy. Let's check out these cucumbers here. Um, since it's been raining, I haven't harvested in a while, so it's really giving me a chance to see how big they're going to get. One of the things that happens when you garden, you get so excited to see something coming along, and the minute it gets to be a good size, you can't wait to harvest it, and sometimes you can harvest a little too early, so the rain is really keeping me from doing that. And over here, so these are my flower pots that we have by the door just for that color that we like to bring into the garden and we have a variety of cherry tomatoes going on here they're listed on our instagram page so if you want to find out what type of um cherry tomatoes we got going on here check us out on instagram um it is in the garden with tucker all lowercase no spaces 
last but not least we got some jalapenos coming along here and some collard greens and this romaine lettuce actually re-sprouted after we cut it it's the only one that did it besides this little one that's coming along here so i'm super excited about that um my husband got all excited this year decided to do some citrus trees so we got a kumquat here and we got a satsuma here and then we got some more uh, bell peppers and just plain red peppers all of these things will go good in the salad with, with what we had in mind when we were shopping you know what do we want to eat what kind of produce do we want to eat and what can we eat with it we want to have salads and wraps and good things like that so that's what we got going on here hope you guys enjoy bye bye Tell him bye, Tucker. All right. <laughs>